Hello, this is going to be my first vlog. Uh, I thought I'd talk to, okay, talk about me a little. Um, well, you may notice in some of my videos I have my ups and downs. That's sort of because doing videos helps me get out of my shell. I have Asperger's syndrome, so I'm usually just the person in the corner being quiet. Um, I've been diagnosed with severe depression. I've been dealing with that since a young age. So that's why sometimes you see me more sullen than some other ones. I'm all giddy. Usually I get more giddy when I'm streaming and talking to my close friends or new viewers, whoever you may be. I wanted to say thank you to my subscribers. I know there's only like 21 of you, but thank you. And I'm glad you actually enjoy my videos. Um, I also thought... I would explain a little bit what was happened to me last year, just so it's out there, I guess. Um, you may have noticed a short or semi-long break, at least long compared to YouTube videos. Uh, in midsummer, I found a lump and was eventually diagnosed with this testicular cancer. Um, so I was dealing with that, then about within two weeks or so, my grandpa was diagnosed with lung and kidney cancer. So that was another thing I had to put up, I was dealing with. I visited him, spent some time with my grandpa and grandma. Uh, I was eventually, uh, well, the lump I found it was getting worse, so it was definitely confirmed as testicular cancer. On September 1st, I had the surgery. It went well. Afterwards, uh, my dad and Aunt Tina uh, got me. I was out back. Uh, everything looked good, at least on my end. But my grandpa was deteriorating pretty fast from the time he was diagnosed, which apparently uh, he may have had quite a while and he was misdiagnosed as uh, asthma for many years and well the day after my surgery my grandpa passed away so that was really rough for everyone uh, me and my I know my little sister agreed that we think he waited to hear that I was okay after the surgery to let go and then I wanted to go to be able to be, his be at his funeral, but uh, I had a really bad hematoma, I couldn't even get out of bed, so I wasn't able to do, go for that, be there for everyone, I should say, and it took about, what was it, another two, maybe two and a half weeks until I could actually walk around pretty well. And, uh, let me see here, oh, about three week, three to four weeks after my surgery, we found out it was malignant, a big, it was a tumor they could have removed, and I could have kept the old lefty. <laughs> so, uh, it's, it's just, it was a rough year last year, really rough. But I started my videos up again when I felt sort of comfortable. Um, one of the reasons why I do videos, um, I don't know, it's just like an outlet. I enjoy it and to be honest, the people that inspired, or that the people that got me even thinking of doing streaming, uh, streaming or recording, uh, first it was, well, Markiplier, um, he, he, he and Jack Septicai actually, Markiplier and Jack Septicai have really helped me along with my friends and family to inspire me to keep doing videos, um, streaming, and they really helped me through a rough time. Not, not just my family and friends, that includes Markiplier and Jack Septicai because they're just goofballs. They're always so happy. And happiness is... And goofiness is 
just spreadable. That's not the word I'm looking for. <laughs> um, addictive? I don't know. Contagious. There we go. In a good way. <laughs> so again, I want to say thank you to, well, friends, family, Mark and Jack for inspiring and helping me. And I also want to thank what little viewers and watchers I have and subscribers. I just hope you guys enjoy what I do. I hope I get better with uh, OBS because eventually my free run of, uh, what is it called, XSplit Gamecaster is going to go out and I can't afford 200 bucks for a lifetime thing right now. Ugh, I'd rather use that on new computer parts. I'm saving up. Oh, I should have mentioned this earlier. Sorry. I'm saving up to get a new mouse. There's a mouse out there, a gaming mouse out there. It can detect your heartbeat, heart rate, and put it on um, the computer screen, which I think would be great for horror games. And again, I want to say thank you to everyone, and I'll see you in the next video, and hopefully my vlog wasn't too bad. Bye!